Our portion this week, Shlach Lecha, provides us with an opportunity to understand the power that faith has to provide us with a positive outlook on life. And I don't make that statement lightly, and it's not a catchphrase, but rather something very serious indeed, because life is difficult to navigate. There are always pitfalls that we come up against, always a crisis, a tragedy, God forbid, etc. And we need a proper foundation, a proper understanding that no matter what we do, everything eventually will be okay. This week's portion, Shlach Lecha, uh, provides us with an insight into the power of faith. Moses designates a representative from each tribe to go into the land of Israel, since they are poised to enter now, uh, and to scout out the land and for 40 days, report back to the people about the condition of the land so that they will be ready in the appropriate way to march in and begin to settle. As we know from this famous story, 12 representatives, one for each tribe, undergo that mission. When they come back, 10 of them report that the land is just, it will be impossible to conquer. The people are giants. We are grasshoppers compared to them, they say. The, the cities are well fortified, and it's, it will be an impossible undertaking. However, Caleb from the tribe of Judah and Joshua from the tribe of Ephraim argue with them and say, no, we believe in God and we know that God will be with us and God will lead us successfully in this mission. Of course, the people of Israel uh, believe the report of the ten tribes, uh, ten spies, and because of that, the people of Israel are punished to have to wander in the desert for the next 38 years. Joshua and Caleb saw the same thing that the other ten spies saw. How, they saw the well-fortified cities. They saw, supposedly, that the people were giants compared to them. Yet they knew that with their faith in God, their understanding that God brought them out of Egypt, God gave them the Ten Commandments of the Torah at Mount Sinai. They witnessed that, just like everybody else did. And that provided them with the strength and the knowledge that no matter what they are about to face and to undertake, that they would be successful. I, this message is a powerful message for all of us, that uh, to, to navigate the chaos that life on earth is, we need a system of ethics, morals, and values in order to ground us, to say that despite what's happening around us, we have a path to travel, and that path will be one that will be filled with justice, uh, a sense of right and wrong, and a sense that somehow we firmly believe that God is with us. That powerful notion provides us with, uh, with the ability not only to navigate life, but also the ability to see blessing every day. Shabbat Shalom.